This video contains explicit content. Viewer discretion is advised. No, seriously, this is your last chance. This is going to get really fucking offensive. What's going on? Glad to see you. I'm here to tell you some stories. On Square, the people have a voice too. I think it's awful. I don't think we need them in town. Do I believe in ghosts? Look, I'm almost getting emotional about that, but do I believe in ghosts? I don't know. I, I, I don't know what to, I don't know what I believe, but I can tell you these stories, you know, make me fucking think maybe there is something. I don't know. I just lived a fucking crazy life and that's just part of like, you know, how it all comes out. I've had a lot of crazy stuff happen to me. You know, there's a lot of things. Every once in a while, something happens that you can't explain. We could do another whole show on I can give you a lot of bad stories, some really crazy stuff. This one is like culminates, like the culmination of everything I've been in and the way I lived my life. This girl here had just died, right? I don't know if I believe in ghosts or not. I don't know, if, I don't know what I believe. I'll give you, ironically, Less than a week later, my friend's down in Florida, right? He was very close with her too. My friend calls me up, goes, Greg, I got, I, I got to tell you something. This is really fucked up what I'm going to tell you. And I said, what happened? And he goes, dude, I'm in this fucking club. I met this girl. She was fucking hot as hell. And we're sitting there and he goes, there's nowhere to go in a club. You can't move. There's so many people. He goes, I'm sitting at the bar. And he goes, this chick is sitting next to me and she was so hot. He goes, so I start talking to her. You know, we hammered down a few drinks. We're getting all lovey-dovey, you know, and she's kissing me, you know, I'm kissing her. And he said, it's hooked onto a hotel. There's a hotel next door, right? It's, it's part of like a hotel, this bar. So she says to me, let's get a room. And I said, fucking A. Next thing I know, I'm talking to her and I look and he goes, I see, her name is Jalissa. I see Jalissa. And the girl's going to me, what, what are you doing? Why are you looking over there? What, what, what you see? Were you looking at some girl or something? And he goes, well, hold on. He goes, I think that that's my friend's girlfriend, but she's dead, it can't be her. He sees Jalissa, guys, I'm not lying to you. And she goes to him. So, the girl goes, come on, come on, stop. You know, I don't know. And he's going, no, wait, 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 it's camp. She goes, there's no dead girl over it. I don't know what you're talking about. And he goes to, he goes to her, hold on. I got to see what this is all about. And she goes, fine, whatever, go. He gets up. He walks over to where she is. And she's standing there, he says. And she looks at him. And the next thing he knows, he hears, bang, bang, bang. And he turns around and he looks. The girl he was sitting with, is on the floor dead with a guy. But well, hold on, with a guy dead. Okay? He turns and looks, and the girl that he thought was Jules is gone. There's no way she can get out of this. No back door. Everybody hit the floor. There was commotion. It was chaos. What had happened was that girl, when Paul got up and went to the bathroom, Another guy sat down and simply said to her, hey, how you doing? What's going on? What's your name? In that short period of time, her husband came into the bar because she had been cheating on him and said, you fucking bitch, you're going to die. Bang, 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 shot the guy he was with because it looked like they were together. And everybody was on top of him. And that's what happened. And my partner, Paul, was shaken. There you go. How's that for a fucking story? That's a true fucking story, you know. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, that is a true story. Now, do I believe that was my girlfriend? I don't know, dear. She's dead. I don't know what you guys believe. I don't know if any of you guys have ever seen a ghost. If you believe in any of that stuff, all I know is that guy, that a, a jealous husband, found out his wife was in a bar. You know, she had been cheating on him. She thought that the guy she was talking to, if my partner Paul would have been sitting there for another fucking 10 seconds, he would have been dead.
What made him get up to leave? I don't know. From when I pissed on the wall of Cow Caverns Cave, I lost my girlfriend, my son, my wife, and, you know, turned on me, went, met another guy. I lost my gym, I sat in jail, I lost my car, cops took $250,000 cash from me, my ex-wife took $210,000 cash from me, and I came out with nothing.